planet Earth. It's home to many really cool creatures. But of all the cool animals on planet Earth, the coolest of them all is the sea urchin. Alright kids, now it's time to dissect your sea urchin. Let's start by identifying some features that are on the top, or the aboral surface. Located right at the center, we can see a nice round anus. And just to the right of the anus, you can see a beautiful madrepore. That's wonderful. Now the outer shell of the sea urchin is known as a test, and the small white dots on it, those are known as tubercles. And off to the side, you can see spine-like projections, which are known as spines. This one has a lot of spines. Now let's take a look at the oral surface. Here we can see the mouth. Inside the mouth, we can see teeth. There are five of them. These ones are especially white. Looks like somebody's been flossing. Around the mouth, we can see the podia, which is that fleshy ring thing. The area around the podia is known as a peristomal membrane. Now it's time for the fun part. Grab your scalpel and give it a nice stab towards the top. After you have a nice little slit cut in the top, grab your scissors and cut out a nice big chunk. Some juice is expected. This one happens to be extra juicy. That is a lot of juice. Keep on cutting. There we go. Now it's opened up. Now we can look at the insides. Snip some more away so we have a clearer view. Oh, beautiful. In the top left, we can see some gonads. Feel free to remove some for better visibility. Coming out of the same side, we can see the intestine. This one's nice and shiny. Here we can see the esophagus. The esophagus goes into that large structure called Aristotle's lantern. If you follow the esophagus into the lantern, becomes a pharynx. The reddish brown ring surrounding the top of the lantern is known as a ring canal. Here we have a piece of the test. By looking at the inside of the test, we can see that it is made up of small plates. They are known as test plates. The brown gooey stuff you see right there is ampullae. That strip of ampullae is part of a modified arm. 
well, that about wraps it up. Now that you're done dissecting your urchin, you should put it back together. Don't forget any pieces, because you may want to dissect it again. Put that test back in place. Perfect.